Hey, it's June 14th. I'm up at the Blue Heron uh, Samuel store. Uh, we got West Coast Metal coming up. Gonna have the lean to built today. And they are gonna be here between 7 a.m. and noon. So I got up here pretty early. I just had breakfast. They have good breakfast up here. But uh, I'm waiting for Dad. Dad's gonna show up and then hopefully those guys will show up. But it is raining today and it's terrible outside. Um, but see, I'm out here at the store with my truck. See the trees blowing in the back back there. But anyways, yeah, hopefully uh, we get this all done. It ought to be interesting. The last time uh, they came up when they had built Mike's uh, lean, or, uh, carport, they, it took them two days because it was raining. So, I, I mean, I took today off of work and I really don't have two days. So hopefully we can get it done today. They're here, they're pulling in right now. So it's uh, 8.59, so we'll be driving up the river. They got here early, which is great. Handing out energy vitamins. <laughs> Good guys. six feet high so 
I sat down here and talked to these guys about all the options we could do. Uh, raising it up a few inches because uh, originally I was planning on it being six and a half feet. Six feet is just barely enough to get my Jeep under and for a person to walk under. But in the end I decided to leave them as they are and possibly down the road I can either, if they're, they're too low, we can modify it and raise them up or just take them off the gable end part so it's easier to get in and out but hopefully it'll be fine. Looks a little low at the moment, but I think it'll be be okay in the end. guys are out here building my lean to I guess I can take a little bit of time to show you where I'm at on I'm framing the inside here I'm getting close to being done this wall is closer I'm gonna go all the way up and divide those upper bays like the bottom ones are and put insulation in there and that's where we'll sheetrock but I'm going right out to here this post right in front of me, that's as far as the, the bar will end up being all the way back. But that's where we're at right now with the framing. I want to get this done hopefully in the next couple weeks and then start insulating and sheetrocking. So. Uh, 
Okay, I'm getting ready to leave. A um, couple things. Uh, that piece of trim, they actually brought up the wrong color um, of trim. It's the pewter gray, and we have Quaker gray for this siding. So. Um, and then also there's going to be some trim that runs along this gap to close that gap, and it wasn't on the truck. So um, they are going to come back up in a couple weeks and, and fix that part. Then, uh, um, but other than that, it looks pretty good. You can just, just walk underneath that bar. It's at six feet. Same thing on this side. That's how it's gonna look. Looks pretty good.